In the book, we put out this idea that what we really need is Redia land. And so let me explain. So first, um, it comes from this word Redia, which we have put together from the words reading and media and merge them. And the reason that we've done that is because we find that too often people think about reading in opposition to media or vice versa, that somehow like the technology is going to impede reading. But from what we found in our research and from some of the really great programs that are happening around the country is that digital media can be harnessed to be a tool to assist with reading. And that means reading even, you know, old fashioned books um, that, that really well-designed TV shows or software can be helpful in getting children over some humps so that they can become stronger readers, but also that media can be a, a place to learn about the world and understand new concepts that can then help one become a deeper reader and have um, much more um, the fluency and comprehension as re uh, they're reading. So what we'd love to do is to sort of start, spark a, a movement around the country to have communities start thinking of themselves as these Redia land places where we bring together the best of media with the best of print and, and the reading resources that we already have in communities and start finding a nice marriage between the two so that children have almost a 360 degree surround sound of literacy opportunities um, where their, their librarians and their teachers and their child care um, professionals and their, um, and their you know, friends and family are all recognizing that there's moments in the use of both screen media and in, me in books to spark conversation, to develop their language, to um, help them become stronger readers.